Hey guys, it's iPod Touch 2G Hacker here, and I'm going to show you the absolute easiest way to jailbreak your iPod Touch second generation on firmware 2.2.1. So, by this time, you probably already have your iPod Touch jailbroken, but the dev team came out with uh, the new beta version for Red Snow. This is, I guarantee, I guarantee you, the easiest possible way, possible way to do it. There's no downloading of anything, no restoring, none of that. You just download the Red Snow folder that I'll have for you in the description. You double click, and of course you have to have your iPod Touch in DFU mode. And if you don't know how to do that, it will give you instructions here in the command line. Now, um, this is, a, like I just said, a command line. Um, but it does everything for you, and uh, there's supposed to be a GUI coming out for it from the dev team uh, in a few weeks it will be quick pwn uh, those who jailbroke their iPhone or iPod touch first generation should be familiar with that one uh, but for the time being we just have this command line so what you do is open the .exe file and by the way uh, this will in no way delete any of your files it's uh, good to keep everything there just like the uh, NOR file from uh, changing the boot logo on your iPod Touch. So what you do here is, all right, all right, guys. So uh, let, I'm gonna try to help you out here with DFU mode. It gives you instructions in the uh, .exe file, but some people are visual learners. So what you do is hold the home button and the power button at the same time for 10 seconds. So here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Now let go of the power button. Continue holding the home button for about nine seconds. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. All right. So now it should be in DFU mode, and uh, I didn't have my speakers on, but it should be unresponsive. And if you have your speakers on on your computer, you will hear a chime. So now let's continue. Alright guys, so once you have your iPod Touch in DFU mode, uh, what you're going to do is hit any key. Uh, I prefer to hit the space bar. Okay. That's just gonna. This is amazing, guys. It downloads everything you need for the jailbreak straight off the internet. You have to download nothing. It does everything for you. Here, you see, it's doing everything for you. Within a few seconds, you should see this screen. Here you see it's doing everything for you. Within a few seconds you should see this screen. Downloading jailbreak data. That's this shouldn't take too long, but here we go. Here we go. Uh, those of you familiar with QuickPone should recognize that logo. It's uh, finishing or flashing the NOR file right now, so we could uh, just do a, like a restore. Like I said before, it's not going to damage anything. It's not going to delete any of your apps or anything like that. Everything's gonna be fine afterwards.
by the way guys uh just as on a quick note um i have the 3.0 beta firmware however uh, i know a lot of people want it but they also want it jailbroken so as soon as uh there's a way to jailbreak it i will have a video for you guys but as of right now i don't really uh feel the need to uh update to the 3.0 beta Okay, so here we see it's booting back up, and there it is. Just let me enter the code here. Okay, and there you have it. Everything is back to normal. All my apps are still there. Music. It's all there, and it is indeed jailbroken. So, uh, there you have it guys, um, like I said, there should be a GUI coming out for it, a quick clone, within a few weeks, uh, and I guess I'll have a video for you guys when that comes out, uh, this has been iPod2G Hacker here for this video, and just remember, rate, comment, and subscribe.